Hello and welcome to this course on Puppet Fundamentals. My name is Yogesh Raheja and I will be taking you through this fantastic journey of automation with Puppet Fundamentals. I have been using Puppet for automation in various solutions around DevOps, infrastructure as code, application deployment and orchestration. Puppet is one of the robust tool with moderate learning curve and can save you a lot of time by automating much of your repetitive work. This Puppet Fundamentals course is a hands-on beginner's guide to Puppet world. When I started learning Puppet at first, some of the concepts took a while for me to get around. So I thought of putting together this course for the absolute beginners. Before we start the real Puppet journey, let me introduce myself. My name is Yogesh Raheja. I have been working as DevOps, Automation and Cloud Coach and Consultant. I have been helping many organizations to start their journey in DevOps, Infrastructure as Code, Containerization, Cloud Computing and assisting them in automating their regular repetitive operations using best automation practices. I have written few books like Automation with Ansible and Automation with Puppet which has been published globally by John and Wiley. This course is co-authored by Mumshad Menambeth, who is a seasoned instructor on Udemy. He has authored multiple bestseller and highest rated courses on DevOps and automation technologies such as Ansible, Docker and Kubernetes and teaches over 22,000 students worldwide. So how exactly does this course work? This course contains lectures on various topics followed by some coding exercises where you will practice writing Puppet programs. You will be developing Puppet codes for different use cases, which will give you a pretty good idea on how to start developing codes using Puppet and get a lot of things done in a short amount of time, which will make your work more productive and collaborative. So what are we going to cover in this course? We will get started with an introduction to Puppet and what Puppet can do. We will go through the Puppet terminology followed by real-time Puppet setup in your environment. Then we will get started with an introduction to Puppet resources which are the basic building blocks to start Puppet coding. We will create a four-way process to create, check, test and run Puppet codes. Then. We will head over to Puppet classes, Puppet manifest, important Puppet configuration files, followed by overview of other Puppet concepts like facts, Puppet modules, Puppet roles and profiles, Puppet forge, M collective, etc. Also, there are a lot of hands-on coding exercises that will get you comfortable with Puppet programming with lots of practice, practice and practice. Then, 